teach you to mess with a Marine. Understand this. You move, you die. You keep pushing, and I'll take that thing from you and beat you to death with it. Try me. I could kill you in a heartbeat. Trust me. I am fast enough. make it it all happened too fast i think it's just you and me just you and me huh well that's just fucking great you don't like it walk away i'll try not to stumble over your corpse you think i'll be safer with you and your scary little broomstick looking for trouble says the american with the gun We don't have to be friends, but we can be allies. That's something I can get on board with. For one second, you're trying to cross me. Best believe me. Following second, you're dead. I kill vampires. You think I'm afraid of a jar head? That looks like our best way through. One of us holds up the gate, the other can slip through. Find another way around. I think there's a way through. I just need to clear it from my side. Do it quick. Those things could be anywhere. You got any idea what we're dealing with? Can we talk about something else, please? I hear you. Like what? Tell me what your home's like. I ain't here to make friends. It's every man for himself. What's the first thing you're gonna do when we get out of here? Hold my son.
9 p.m. Something unholy has happened. As I sat with my wife, I noticed something in her hand. Lady Bradshaw's brooch. She must have pulled it from her shirt when she grabbed at her. Turning it over, I noticed that it looked like one of the creatures we'd exhumed from the cocoons. Were these the demons Mary had spoken about? Had Bradshaw known all along what we'd find down here? Then Mary's corpse moved. It was not my wife. It was something inhuman. It leapt at me, and only the bars of the cell spared me from its fury. You seem like you got your head screwed on, so I gotta ask. What the hell made you sign up with Saddam? For us, we had no choice. is the meaning of those markings on your hand. It's to honor the dead. It's the reason I fight. It's as good a reason as any. It's a damn good reason. The only reason. Believe as you like. Fuck's that supposed to mean? Back at the farm, you shot that shepherd in the back because of what? He attacked your country? was nothing but a goat farmer. I think you need to give your mouth some rest. Should we get the fuck out of here? Looks to me like a medical bay. This could come in handy. If you want to stick 60-year-old explosive in your bag, be my guest.
Those chemical weapons are close, right? Every time you say something smart, you follow it with something dumb. These things are. They feed on blood. Vampires. Uh, not just blood, though. Adrenaline. They want their prey scared before they make the kill. They're doing a good job, then. down there those explorers got there first now hold up will you what are you doing you think they're still alive that's hopeful hope is all we got left Jack in the box. What do you make of it? It's like nothing I've ever seen. You see that elevator cable? The explorers must have gone down. I don't think they made it back up. That winch still looks functional. No. No? We are not going down there. The archaeologists didn't make it out. What does that tell you? We're not archaeologists? Our world is up there, not down below. Well, there's an army of monsters between us and the world above. They're close. Fire it up. You're crazy. If those vampires come from anywhere down there, you really want to find them in their own home? What I've been doing since I set foot in this country. Get that elevator working.
An ancient horror has awoken from its slumber and is hungry for blood. Shall we see how many have fallen into shadow? Rachel found her way back to the light. Well done. All a lie. Although don't get complacent, their lives still hang by a thread. Let's hope nothing unfortunate has befallen Sergeant K. Those taken by the abyss seldom live to tell the tale. As for Jason and Salim, sworn enemies who cannot seem to bury the hatchet, unless that hatchet is buried in a bag. I don't want to seem like an ungracious host, but time is against us. I'll be here to greet your charges as they cross the finishing line, or to bury what remains of them under it. and I'm done trying to explain it to you. Yes, yes, this is my life now and I'll live it on my terms. Wait, what, what did you just say? Oh, uh, bad time? Yeah, it's a real fucking bad time. I'm just dropping off the files you requested. Not now. I said not now. Well, I, I didn't mean to upset you. It's not you. Seems like out here we're we're all running away from something. I know I am. You were caught up in that mess at the checkpoint. You shot that woman. No, it's okay. But you could talk to me. It's just everyone seems to have an opinion on it. I'm dealing with it in my own way. Are you? You got your own problems. And whoever that was, that sounded like a, a gold medal asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it is, you'll deal with it. Or say the word. And I'll handle it for you. Nick, I thought I lost you. I thought I'd lost you. Right. Eric.
shit, it's malfunctioning. Colonel, you gotta go! You two, Nick, they're coming with us! Come on, Ray! Clear. That was too close. Come on, Marine, follow me. You think that thing's gone? Looked like it went down that tunnel. He's alive. Jason's alive. Maybe things aren't going so badly after all. I can't do this anymore. It's time. It's got to be time. Time for what? You know what? We lay the cards on the table. Rachel, I know you said to put things on ice, but can't pretend like this didn't happen. I'm done lying. And especially with you wearing your ring again. No wonder you didn't have the courage to tell me. I was someone back at the base. I didn't realize you were sleeping with one of your own damn team. Roll it out for us. Now? Right fucking now? Yes, now. We may not have another chance. Fine. Eric, you and I, we had something very special, but that was a long time ago. Him? You're choosing him. This isn't about choosing. It's about knowing what's best for me. I don't have feelings for you, Eric. Not anymore. You either, Nick. We're done. I don't believe it. Believe it. We were over a year ago. I don't need anyone's help to climb out of this hell. So now you both know. 
Maybe we can stop fucking around and go find Kolchak. I can fix this. Would help if you weren't in the damn picture. You want me out of the way? You're gonna have to move me. Put up or shut up. You're not worth the effort. 